welcome to Fleetcom. Uh, I'm Jason, and this is Alex. Um, so we just got word from AN Games last week that they are thinking about banning multi-devicing. They did some, I guess, like research, and they just found that it it's kind of a big cause of lag on um, on the server end. So they're gonna take a look at it and. Um, I don't know if they're gonna like totally do a blanket ban or like a warning or something like that or just kind of cut it out of the system. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be that you can't use. You just can't like once, do it once you log into another device. Probably logs out. Yeah. Uh, if they get rid of it, I think that it's gonna be a better thing for the game all around. Uh, if it helps lag, then you know, hell yeah, that's like an awesome, awesome bonus. Should we look at Kyle's account? Yeah, let's go ahead. Uh, Kyle. Account he's level fifty nine, but his defense record is kind of Im amazing, like eighty three percent, as a uh, for for his defense record, and ninety nine percent win record. He's defending against people who are like seventy seven levels, like twenty levels higher than him, and still beating the crap out of him. And I checked out his league. He's fighting against like people who are ni ninety one, level one hundred, mm. ninety two. What level is he? He's fifty nine. Fifty nine. So yeah, this account is kind of like a twink, like a super account for his level. Yes, Clara, Cannon Defense Hero, got the Event Hero, Ad Adriana, I think. Yeah, Adriana, Piercing Fire. Yeah. David, David's saying he's running squirrels. Yeah, he's running uh, destroyers. He has some other <laughs> good heroes here. Michael Amato is like, Kyle's a veteran from Denev. He knows what's up. He knows what to yeah. do. Uh, yeah, that's what I said. I said it, he, he's a twink. This is his twink account. Yeah. So this is another great hero that he's not even using. I would even consider switching over to this guy. But I guess he hasn't researched cruisers. So, yeah. So, yeah, it's a great account. And let's see what kind of trons he uses. Ability, ability, ability. <laughs> yeah, ability, guys. Remem remember, especially... For destroyer masters, ability is what you want. Ability with evasion. And oh my god. Also, you want ability, of course, for combat heroes. Yeah, he has some very good heroes here for his level. And let's check how much evasion he has. He's level 59, so. <laughs> yeah, he has over 300 evasion at uh, level 59. <laughs> That's, That's awesome. Yeah. You're, you're not gonna meet a lot of people who can, like, actually hit him at this level yeah that's uh, nuts exactly so like as long like at level 100 it like destroyers like lose their value a bit but mm -hmm. at this level destroyers are definitely like they I think like well here's here's a really good question uh, last week we threw up a post that was um it was kind of like here's an empty mothership like what would you put on it and a couple of people were just like, oh, motherships are broken. Like, there's no reason to use anything other than a mothership. Like, um, what what is the counter argument to that? Like, what? I think besides, like, you're, you're an a idiot. Lot of, a, lot like, of, a lot of people use battleships. A lot of people use cruisers. A lot of people use destroyers, even at level 100. Yeah. It's just like, mothership is the best, like, overall sh ship. Mm -hmm. And especially for combat fleets like the he heroes in, in, in the back because they can't really stack up on uh, evasion so for combat heroes it's, us it's usually better with uh, mother ships mm. some people might use battleships just to like kill off the enemy faster but in general people use mother ships especially for the combat heroes mm. uh, but Michael Amato is saying uh, mother ship is guaranteed to get hit so piercing fire will wreck them yeah so for tanks M M mothership is not always the best but definitely for combat heroes it's either motherships or combat I mean battleships mm. but I know that some people with motherships if they use that electronic jamming I think and if you have a lot of ability you can s get to like 400 evasion on motherships if not more so mm. Yeah, sometimes it can help if the enemy doesn't expect you to have a lot of evasion. So let's just go to Chris Atkins account. First let's check out his account. Okay. 
So he has a spread fire beam hero here. He has an awesome defense shield hero here. Would maybe have been better if the ability was boosted, but other than that, stat distribution is awesome. Defense shield. He has a intercept missile. Sadly, the govern seems to be a little high. Oops, I was gonna check out this Tron. Yeah, that's 44 from gov. Uh, 44 govern from a Tron. So, but yeah, it's still a bit high. Mm. He has Maya here. No problem, Kyle. Yeah, thanks, thanks, Kyle. Then we have uh, Clara on random fire here, but using a EXP Tron leadership. Yeah, you should definitely get some ability up here. What else? What is that? Oh shit! Explosive fire with very good stat distribution as well. What else does he have? What is this? Counter fire, decent stat stat distribution. Governance mm -hmm. a little bit high. Other than that, yeah, nothing that special. So you don't like he has a strong lineup, but he could do better. And mm -hmm. looking at your trons, by the way, should definitely try to get some, some uh, uh, ability up on your heroes here, and get exteriors on on your trons as well. Yeah, it's like does he need leadership at this low of a level? Well, leadership is al always good, but you should always focus on ability, ability, ability. Hmm. All right, so you hear that, Chris? Ability. Yeah. Gonna check out his uh, devices. He doesn't seem to be focusing on resistance, which he should. And yeah, like, a as he's from like Kyle's account, uh, he was level 59 and he had over 300 division. This is a level. Oh, wait, uh, we got a question really fast. Uh, Sorry, Hendrik DW, question on resistance. Do you guys use both hybrid and pyro armor yeah, at the same time? Max for out your yeah, resistance. Yeah, that's good. Uh, always. Yeah. So, yeah, his evasion here is at 230 uh, compared to Kyle, who had over 300. So, yeah, sh with the ability trance, you should be able to reach way, way higher evasion. So, get those ability trance and exteries on. Using seems to be using a little bit of a mix here. M Modded ship is level three. He should definitely also upgrade his ships. Seems like you've been leveling a bit. Yeah. Quickly here. Yeah, mothership three is pretty low for level seventy nine. Like, I'm pretty sure, like if he meets an enemy with random fire, he just gonna get wiped out. Yeah. So yeah, and try to focus. Since you're not level one hundred yet, try to just focus on mother ships. That's my advice. Motherships and maybe evasion on this defense shield guy. Yeah. Gonna check out his research here quickly and has yeah. to see if he has done that. If he has been a good boy. Yeah, he has been a good boy. All right. All right. Awesome. He has all three here. Yeah. And what? No, that was fleet again. Weapons. He's been a good boy yeah. with th that as well. Yeah, awesome. Nice, Chris. Let's open his S hero invite to S. And just a quick recap about your account focus on ability and also get resistance up on on your all of your ships and finally uh focus on modder ships uh for your level like once you reach level 100 you can like branch out a little bit get like get your battleships leveled up and or your cruisers but for now focus on like destroyer and modder ships in my opinion we'll see you all next time uh super awesome this is like yeah this is a record there's 16 people in the chat right now so everybody thanks for coming pleasure to have you and again if you want to participate you can either message uh me or alex or just message the facebook page and we will feature your account also please send us your league videos for replay okay yeah all right guys see you later bye 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 bye